It should improve skin elasticity and hydration in order to reduce fine lines and wrinkles. Let's break down what each of these peptides actually does on a cellular level. GHKCU is a copper peptide naturally found in the human body. It helps regulate gene expression, particularly genes responsible for collagen, elastin, and glycosaminoglycan production. It's been studied for promoting wound healing, reducing inflammation, and even resetting gene expression to a more youthful state. On the skin, it may improve elasticity and reduce the appearance of fine lines. BPC-157 stands for body protection compound. It's a peptide fragment derived from gastric proteins and is known for its ability to enhance blood vessel formation, accelerate tissue repair, and reduce inflammation. It's particularly popular among biohackers and athletes for its reported gut healing and joint support properties. TB-500 is a synthetic version of a peptide called thiomyosin beta-4. Its role in the body includes promoting cell migration, blood vessel growth, and new tissue generation. TB-500 is often included for its ability to support recovery from soft tissue injuries and reduce systemic inflammation. Together, these peptides are believed to create an internal environment that supports skin health and whole body recovery. 